sitting at 19 and 12 on the season with a 9 and 9 conference record. It's been a roller coaster of a year for the Florida Gators. From the high of beating the number two ranked Auburn Tigers to the low of falling to Texas Southern at home. Now, as the SEC tournament kicks off, the Gators will face a Texas A&M squad that they suffered just a one point loss to earlier in the season. But head coach Mike White says the Gators had their chances in that one and just didn't take advantage. So they'll no doubt be ready to get some redemption come tip off. They made plays down the stretch, um, you know, when they needed to. Uh, defensively, we, we had a couple breakdowns there at the end uh, that, that um, if it weren't for those, uh, we may have been able to, uh, to come out on top. Uh, they beat us the first time. Um, they're obviously a lot better than they were that time, and they beat us. So uh, we got to be ready. They have some really good guards, um, and they get downhill. They know how to score the ball at every level. You know, we, we've studied them. We've done, we've done what we're supposed to. Um, and, you know, we're ready for the opportunity. We just got to do what we're supposed to. At the end of the day, that's what it boils down to. Like, there's nothing more than that. We got to just bring our A game. It's win or go home. And winning isn't just crucial for success in this tournament. If the Gators want to make it into the NCAA tournament, they're going to have to make a fairly deep run here and prove themselves to the committee. I would just say win games. That's probably the biggest thing. You got to win games. So whatever we got to do to, to win games, that's, that's all it boils down to. Everybody knows it. We've got to win games. You know, that's it, up to the committee and, and, um, and the people that, that – uh, um, you know, do it for a living. Not only those guys, I guess. You know, but but Lenardi and, and all of the other experts in the field. Um, they can they're they're going to make cases and they're going to put people in and have people out. And all we can focus on is is Texas A&M. And that contest with A&M tips off at noon right here at Amelie Arena. Rachel West, Tampa Bay Times.